what's up outsiders i am here at letchworth state park a new york state park it's been voted number one state park in the country letchworth is also known as the grand canyon of the east because of this magnificent gorge that we have that is about 600 feet from top to bottom i'm here in near peak fall foliage you can see golds reds yellows behind me just a beautiful beautiful time to visit Letchworth I'm gonna show you guys all of the major waterfalls the upper middle or lower as well as a bonus Wolf Creek that you can only see on a raft trip with adventure calls I just finished my raft trip today and uh, got some footage from down there I'm also gonna to go to all the major overlooks inspiration point archery field which I'm at right now we're gonna go over to Humphreys Great Bend and also to Tea Table. I hope you enjoy this tour of Letchworth State Park. Behind me is the brand new railroad bridge spanning the Genesee River. It just opened in 2019. It was under construction for a few years, closed one of the entrances, but they really did a nice job with this area and it's open up for viewing. Unfortunately, you can't walk across the bridge anymore. Behind me is the Glen Iris, which is William Pryor Letchworth's estate. Today it's used as a restaurant and hotel. It has a very unique feature around the other side. I'm going to go show it to you. The gravity fountain. It shoots up about 30 feet and it's gravity fed. And what's really cool about it is in the winter, it creates this giant ice volcano that can be 20, 30 feet tall. It's really, really cool to see in the winter. Also from the Glen Iris, you get a pretty good view of the Middle Falls from above. This inspiration point it's a great overlook where you can see both the middle and the upper falls from this one location it's beautiful the lower falls area can be access from a couple different places there's a parking lot right at the lower falls and then by adventure calls my rafting office you can also walk the trail up that way and you arrive at this sign lower falls trail so we've got 127 steps down to the footbridge and the viewing area unfortunately the footbridge has been closed for the last couple of years due to erosion on the other side of the bridge but we'll get a good look at the lower falls This is the Lower Falls, the last of the three major waterfalls, also referred to as the Three Sisters. We start our raft trips just downstream of this at Lee's Landing.
what's called Humphreys Overlook. It's arguably the best overlook and best view that you can get of the gorge from the road. You can see a large part of the gorge as well as the river. Not a lot of people go to this. They end up at the archery field and never come maybe a quarter of a mile down the road to see this. Awesome, awesome view. We're at the Great Bend Overlook. It's named after the large bend in the river that happens here. It's about halfway on our whitewater rafting trips. Here's a little bonus part of the park. If you're ever here wondering what the heck this wall is, it's actually a wall that funnels wildlife to a tunnel they built underneath the road specifically for the timber rattlers that are here in, this, in the park. I guess they, their breeding ground is over on that side of the road and then they make their way into the gorge. What the park constructed is this wildlife tunnel that runs underneath the road and comes out on each side and allegedly they have put snake pheromones inside the tunnel so the snakes know how to cross. I don't know if it's effective or not, but kind of a cool idea, cool project. Glad they're trying to conserve the wildlife in the park. Behind me is Wolf Creek. It's a large spring fright creek that runs through the park and empties into the Genesee River. Wolf Creek has four cascades with the last cascade only being able to be seen and accessed from the water. So if you come on a raft trip or do a kayak trip on the Genesee River, the only way you're gonna see that waterfall is if you hike up the creek from the Genesee River down in the gorge. of Letchworth in the fall. It's a beautiful, beautiful place. Probably the best time to see Letchworth is in the fall. And a great way to see Letchworth in all its glory is on a rafting trip with yours truly. If you're ever in the park, let me know and uh, call Adventure Calls and we'll get you down in the gorge for some white water and some gorgeous views. Hope you liked this video. If you did, be sure to click that like button. If you wanna see other white water adventures, other New York State parks, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate that. That's it for now. I'll see you guys outside. Oh yeah, and if you ever come here, keep off the walls.